Do you remember when EA said that Team of the Year cards were the best cards that a player can get? Well, I guess they've changed their mind because as you can see, Team of the Season Ronaldo is higher rated than Team of the Year Ronaldo, which obviously is pretty interesting. Anyway guys, welcome to this video and welcome to the Team of the Season Liga BVVA side. It looks absolutely incredible and every single player is incredibly high rated. I think stats wise, it probably is the best Team of the Season ever and if you're opening packs tonight, I do wish you the best of luck because if you pack one, you're probably going to be pretty damn happy. But I've got to say, the chance of you packing one of these players is going to be extremely low because they are so freaking high rated. Also, if you guys could wish me some good luck, that would be awesome because I'm going to need it if I want to pick up any of these players because they're going to be expensive, but I still want to pick some of them up to do player reviews on them. Anyway guys, in the comments below, let me know what you make of this team this season. Let me know which players from it you want me to review. I will say right now, I don't think I'm going to be able to afford Ronaldo, Messi or Suarez at the current time. Oh, one more thing before we talk about some of these players. Each week, we have an ultimate team tournament where you can unlock a team of the season card that isn't actually in packs. Who do you think that's going to be this week? Some people on Twitter are actually saying it could be Gareth Bale. I don't think EA would give away for free a team of the season that is that high rated but who knows let me know your thoughts in the comments below I personally think it could be someone like Inaki Williams maybe Baston or someone like that let me know your thoughts in the comments right then let's talk about some of these players who should we talk about first personally the card that I'm most looking forward to trying out is actually Griezmann just because I love him on this year's FIFA he's probably my favorite player and that striker card looks absolutely incredible of course, I have to give a mention to Suarez, Ronaldo and Messi who all have some absolutely incredible stats on their cards, but I don't want to talk about them too much as we already know they're going to be the best cards in the game, we know they're going to be expensive and we know they're going to be incredibly hard to pack. One card I definitely want to talk about is Team of the Season Godin, the Atletico centre-back who has 98 defending. I actually think this card will be better than Team of the Year Ramos. Now let's go on to the bench and reserves because there are two cards on there that are catching my eye. One of them being Team of the Season Adariz who looks absolutely incredible. He's got 80 pace, 95 shooting and 92 physical and his previous cards were brilliant so this Team of the Season card could be absolutely awesome. And I know he's 91 rated but hopefully he'll be a lot cheaper in comparison to the other La Liga Team of the Season cards. The other card that is catching my eye is this one, Team of the Season, Lucas Perez, who's got 84 pace, 88 dribbling, 89 shooting, 86 passing and 80 physical. Hopefully he'll be cheap because he looks brilliant. Anyway guys, those were some of my thoughts on the La Liga Team of the Season. Be sure to let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I will reply to most comments as I normally do and I'm looking forward to seeing the comments about the ratings of Ronaldo, Messi and Suarez. Anywho, thanks for watching and hopefully I'll see you tonight for a player review. Thanks for watching, have a good day, adios.